We we'll return you to the story where we told you that the Lagos State Governor has advised that all remain steadfast, united, and as one great people, and to also hope in the renewed mantra of hope of the All Progressives Congress. Our correspondent, Lobby Kukuyo Dokun, was at the Democracy Day event in Lagos and now reports. <laughs> It is the 30th anniversary of June 12. The day commemorates what is adjudged to be one of Nigeria's freest and fair democratic election, believed to have been won by the late Chief MKO Abiola. People across all tribes and tongues, ages, creed, or color gathered at various centers in Lagos State to mark the historic day. Lagos State Governor Babajide Sawunlu represented by his deputy, Dr. Obafemi Hamzad, paid glowing tributes to the late MKO. He described June 12 as a watershed and a turning point in the political history of Nigeria. We are getting there, and for every Nigerian to understand that no process designed by a human being will be 100% perfect. So, of course, we cannot ask for democracy and behave in an undemocratic way. So there has been an election. There are processes to adjudicate. And so as long as that process is ongoing, we should all unite to build our country because that is the essence. He also commended President Bola Chinubu as a major player in the journey to enthroning an enduring democracy in Nigeria. The renewed hope is a mimic of a sort of the hope agenda then because the reality is we need to build this country and that's what is doing what will be done about agriculture what will be done about our economy he has said for the first time the gdp of our country will rise by six percent so we have to do what we need to do until the emergence of president balati Numbu, i believe that it has been significantly negative what the military, the politicians in military uniform did to us in 1999 was that rather than allow Nigerians to pick a leader of their choice, they went ahead and foisted on us one of the former military commander in chief. We are ready to express ourselves, to define democracy, to define the image of the country in the community of nations. And it's also significant in the sense that for the first time after June 12, since for the past 30 years, a major actor in that scheme is now the president of Nigeria. We hope that he will learn from the trauma, the pains of Nigerians. Abiola Edewo also spoke on what Chinubu's presidency means for the entrenchment of democracy in Nigeria. See, Ashwajibola Metinubu is a very loyal person. Ashwaju and MKO, when I saw um, Femi, Femi Bajabi Amila, Mr. Speaker, with Ashwaju during the campaign trail. It reminded me so much of my dad and Ashwaju. Highlights of the event was a traditional laying of reeds with prayers said at the graveside of the late Chief MKU Abiola. Love Ikuku Uyeduku, Plus TV News. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.